My story begins in the year 2017, where me and my friend Alicia were on Snapchat, and I had a really big crush on this hockey boy at my school. He was really sweet, he was really nice, helpful, and I really liked him. I wanted to confess to him, but was way too scared, so... One day in summer, me and my friend Alicia were going across his name, and she's like, Hey, why don't we confess to your crush? I'm just like, wait, what? She's like, well, you always wanted to, right? And I'm just like, yeah, of course I wanted to, but I don't want to confess today. She's like, come on, you want to let him know, right? And if you don't tell him, he'll never know. And I'm just like, you know what? Okay, let's do it. So we got my phone, and she did most of the texting, because I was too nervous. She did a long paragraph saying, well, I liked you for a really long time now, and hopefully we can get to know each other, and if it's okay, you don't like me. And I'm just like, wait, before you send it, I want to read it. And then she sent it. And I was like, what have you done? You just blew up the whole universe with me in it. And she was like, don't worry, I sent it. And I said to her, well, he doesn't know that. So I was panicking the whole entire time. We waited about like two hours. And eventually he came back with a response. And I said to her, I don't want to look at it. What if he says no? What if he says yes and it goes all awkward? She's like, do you want me to read it out for you? And I was like, yeah, sure. So she opened it. And I was nervous and excited at the same time. I was covering my eyes. And she opened the snap. And she looked up at me with a sad face. I was like, what? What is it? And she's like, girl, I'm really sorry. And I thought she was joking because she's like a really jokey person. She loves to joke around all the time. It's like, okay, what is it? And she's like, this is what he said. Okay, I'm sorry, but I don't really like you the same way. Don't worry, it won't be awkward. We're still good friends. And I'm just like, Wh what? So I grabbed the phone out of her hand and started scrolling through the messaging. And I saw what he said. I'm just like, oh my god. I can't believe we did this and I can't believe I got this. I shouldn't have done told him at all. And she's like, don't worry, it's a good thing that you told him now. Now he knows. And I'm just like, now he knows that he hates me. And now he knows that I'm really nervous to see him at school. So... I was upset, oh, really upset. I didn't cry at all. I was just hiding it in. And then I messaged him saying, oh, it's okay, thanks for your honesty. <laughs> Secretly, I was crying inside. And then my friend Alicia turned to me and said, are you okay? And I was like, yeah, yeah, I'm fine, <laughs> covering the tears. She's like, well, I have to go home, I'll see you later. And I was like, okay, bye. And then the whole afternoon, I didn't know what to say. I didn't know whether to talk to him anymore or just not speak to him at all. So I just left it there. And we're still chatting today, and it's still, like, not awkward. We're still good friends. It's just I really wish he knew that I still like him, and I really wish that he liked me. Oh, well. Oh, my God, and we totally jumped off the cliff and had to zoom all the way to shore because the dog chases us all the way to the end. Oh.